Hello, Cancer. This is your daily for the 11th and the 12th. If you're new, welcome to the channel. This is for Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. You guys, please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel. Before I get started, I need to um, say something to, I don't know, Miss Smith. I don't know if you're watching this video. I'm not really sure um, what your sign is, but I received your payment. And I need your contact information, so please email me, okay? Please email me so we can get it going. I have no way of contacting you. Let's see what the angel prayers has for my cancers today. Take a step back. Thank you, angels, for helping me to step back from what's not serving me. Hmm. Let's see, my cancer friends. Hmm. I feel like that's exactly what you're doing. Trying to feel better. Trying to block out those things that um, are not, you know, for your higher good. That's not vibing with you here. Standing your ground. Healing. You just want to be happy. And I feel like... A lot of you, my cancers, are. If you're not quite there, honeys, you are working on it, okay? With the star and the sun being here. You are feeling stronger in yourself, who you are. Um, your self-confidence is, is rising. Uh, and you're just like, your eyes are open, I feel. Let's see why this is happening. Could be a Leo you're involved with, or um, you may be on the cusp here. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, a lot of Leo energy present, but I think you guys are being um, being defensive because you know, and just kind of removing yourself from a situation where somebody was not you know, was very closed off with you, not very loving, not very giving, maybe even like very frugal and stingy with their money, you know, not want to share with you even, not giving you a whole lot of time. Um, and all this had you confused about, about um, this whole situation with this person. But I feel like, you know, you're getting your clarity here. The Seven of Cups. But I, I think that a lot of you still feel really attached to someone and you don't really know why here. You don't know whether you love this person or, you know, if they're meant to be for you. Or maybe you just feel like maybe this is an infatuation with this person, but you don't even know why because they're closed off to you. So it's like you're questioning yourself. You're questioning yourself here with the Seven of Cups. Like, you know, why do I even like them or why do I even want them? Because, you know, they don't even show me a whole lot of affection, a whole lot of attention. They don't even like to spend time with me. They're not even giving towards me. So you're kind of confused there. Um, but I feel that that you are addressing these issues you know i think you're seeing through the bull crap with the sun being here you're figuring things out for sure okay let's see what the outside influence is and you may even think that this person has um options or or somebody else you might I don't really think it has anything to do with like anybody else though. But they may also feel like, you know, you have options because you have blocked them out. Um, you guys are exhibiting the same kind of energy here right now. But I think yours is like a reaction to how they have treated you. And they, they are quite confused about that. They're trying to figure this out. And you're trying to figure out why you still have these feelings for them because of how they treat you. So let's see what the outside influence is for you guys. Yeah. Hmm. Somebody can't figure out whether they want to um, 
work together or not <laughs> it's, it's really kind of confusing energy and I see why you guys are confused here because you have a very confusing person on your hands here this energy can go vice versa okay could be a Capricorn you're dealing with as, as well that is your opposite sign here with this three of pentacles but they can't figure out what if they if they love you want to offer love to you or not it's like they're hot and cold here is what I'm feeling they're hot and cold but I, I think this person will come back in but I think there is a need for you to stand your ground here do not accept anything less than what you deserve my cancer friends okay what is advice hmm don't worry about this don't carry this burden okay go on and do what makes you happy if this person comes back and they come back the right way wonderful but if they don't you keep on trucking okay you can do this you can do this be strong enough to see through this this bull crap because this is like a haze for you right now okay um, it does matter how you feel but at this point what matters most is that they're not expressing anything they're holding back you know that's enough that's enough to keep it moving okay so my cancers that's what i have for you guys and i'll speak with you soon bye now